Back in the big top, our vet Joe has been giving a clean bill of health to another exotic animal. This has to be, I think, the longest creature we've ever had on the Animal Roadshow. Tell me who you've got here. Right, this is Stan, and Stan is a Burmese python. And he looks wonderful here today, but um, we've just seen in the film about the rescue of these exotic pets, the snakes. Um, just tell me what kind of state he was in when you first got him. Um, when we first got him, uh, we went to pick him up from a vet's where he'd been placed. He was mite-infested, had uh, anemia as a result of the blood loss, and a respiratory infection. And what about keeping him in the house? What's it like? I mean, does he, right. does he completely rule the house? Stan doesn't free roam in the house. Uh, we've got a lot of other animals, um, all of which would be food. Right. Stan has his own bedroom. Lucky old Stan. A lucky yeah. old Stan, yep. And um, the heating bill is phenomenal. I can imagine, because obviously, being a tropical creature, That's you've got to right. keep him. He's looking at me with a look of, <laughs> you look tasty. Are you a rat? I'm not a rat. I mean, that, that's what he eats, is it, rats? Uh, the, yeah, he, he eats rats. At his size, he should probably be eating something bigger. But we haven't not managed vets. to persuade... <laughs> vets will do. Yeah, small okay. children. Um, uh, stand back. <laughs> um, and, and how often would you feed him? Right, he, we feed him about once every two weeks, but okay. occasionally he'll go without food. Recently, where he had his respiratory infection, was three months. Right. And, but and in the wild, they can go six, nine months without food after a big meal. Right. And that's when they kind of look, you know, you can see the outline of the animal yes. inside them. <laughs> yeah. um, and and um, when he eats, that's when he gets in a bit of a bad temper. He yes. sounds quite hungry at the moment. But, um, just <laughs> tell me just what, you, round. what you do when you feed him. You don't walk up to him with the rat and put your hand out because no. your hand might equally be food. Um, we actually end up tying the rat on the end of a piece of string and pulling it along the floor from a distance. That's a bit different to feeding a cat <laughs> or a dog, isn't it? Very different, yeah. yes. And when he strikes, it's, it's so fast that even now it still scares me. Blimey. Um, and he gets quite angry. That's when he's quite potentially likely that's, to bite you, yeah. isn't he? If they yeah. miss their prey, anything that's warm, they'll have a go at to try and catch. And uh, do you think these would make good pets? I mean, uh, people <laughs> keeping them just as, as pets? Because they start off really small, don't they? They start small, they grow very big. This one isn't yet fully grown. He will get to potentially about 20 foot. Wow, and how big is it at the moment? Um, yeah. We think he's about 13 foot, but it's very, right. very difficult. I... They, because of the size and the difficulty in keeping them, they don't really make suitable pets. It's really hard to appreciate how long it is, because he sort of goes <laughs> under the table, <laughs> round there, sort of thing. So That's we've got a big... tape measure here, um, <laughs> and with a bit of help from um, Tom, the cameraman here, <laughs> we're just going to demonstrate how big he really is. For you now carry on there that's about six foot keep going keep going <laughs> right where are we that's 11 foot keep going keep going a bit further right yeah, there fine. we are 13 feet i mean that's, that's a phenomenal <laughs> size isn't it i mean imagine that crawling around crawling around your bedroom it does <laughs> and, and you said he's going to get bigger potentially 20 foot so he's going to get to 20 i mean that really is a right old handful and i think mm. if you bring him back when he's that size we're going to need to get a bigger beat <laughs> I don't think I'll be carrying him around when he gets to that size. I don't think so. Well, thank yes. you ever so much for bringing him in. It's great to see him. And I think I'll stand well clear in case he is getting peckish. <laughs> you don't want to take him home? <laughs> yeah.